Hello everybody, welcome back to the Tips and Tricks videos. My name is Lars, I'm from MA Lighting Tech Support and um, in our series about commands and cues, I would like to show you today how you can send MIDI notes from the command column of your cues. First of all, when you want to learn a little bit more about, um, about MIDI in general, then you can have a look here on Wikipedia, here is an interesting article about MIDI, which tells you, which tells you everything uh, you need to know about this protocol. Furthermore, you can have a look at the .2 help files for additional information. Um, what I have done, I created a master sequence with four empty queues. You can see over here that my show file is, of course, very empty. There is nothing patched inside. It's just a basic show file to show you how you can send MIDI notes. Please keep in mind that MIDI notes are only sent from a session master. So if you run in a session with a backup, for example, then uh, you need to plug the MIDI cable into the right console, into the master console. Um, when you have a look at the tools menu, there is a MIDI monitor. And in the MIDI monitor, you can send, see the MIDI notes which you are sending. Um, this is for your information, just to see if you send the right notes which are requested by your receiver. When I hit now the go button, you can see over here that uh, my MIDI command is executed. I send out channel number two, note 12, velocity 127. Um, this is the command which I'm using for this uh, this MIDI note. It's MIDI note 12. And when you don't uh, choose a specific channel, like I have done it in uh, queue number two, um, here you can see I'm using channel number one, which is the number before the dot. So channel number one, note 12, and still the same velocity. Um, Channel number two comes from um, the setup MIDI show control menu. Over here, you can define a channel which you are using to send out the MIDI notes. So per default, every time this channel is used, as long as you don't define a specific channel, which you can do with this command. Um, back to the, uh, to the MIDI monitor and I hit the go button again. Here you can see I'm sending out channel number two, which is the selected channel, note number 12 again, and a different velocity. So the 60 behind the 12 is the velocity. This is the note and this is the velocity. Again, the go button. Now I send out the MIDI uh, off command, which is very important in, when you communicate with MIDI. And how I have done this, I stored an empty queue somewhere, hit the view button, open up the queue list, go to the command part of the queue, write down MIDI, MIDI note two, velo MIDI note two, velocity 55. So now I hit this button and when I go back to the uh, MIDI monitor, I can see my velocity, my channel, Two is used from the MIDI money uh, from the MIDI shock control menu, note number two and velocity 55, which is according to my command. That's how easy it is, folks. Um, that's basically all today. Um, hopefully, this was helpful for you. Um, take care. Bye bye.